so in this video let me tell you how you can download this tutorial file so basically this is a github repository where i placed all this tutorial files and upcoming files as well so the, here all your files will be available so what you have to do is directly just clone this repository in your ROS workspace so which ROS workspace to choose for example if you can see in my folder then you can see so many workspaces but the most famous you know is catchkin workspace within this src you can even place but i am not going to place over here because there are so many workspace and i do not want to make you confuse this so if you are only using one workspace then that's okay you place inside that workspace that's completely fine but now i am going to create a new workspace i will name it tutorial workspace is your wish you can create this tutorial workspace or put in catchkin workspace or any other workspace now i'll create a src within this src i'm going to put all my files now let me open the terminal let me go to this tutorial workspace src and all this command i've already mentioned in this git repository okay so you can check them out you have to just clone this now just copy this repository link go back over here go inside this git clone so basically we are cloning the git repository now our git repository is cloned now let's go back and build this because this is a ROS workspace so let's build this so it will take some time to build up now you can see this this workspace is built and you can see the build and devil files over here now what you have to do is you have to directly use these files now if if ever happens that there are some more plugins that i have added on this there are some more folders and files i have added on this then what you have to do is basically you have to go again to your within your see this is the gazebo plugin so go inside this gazebo plugin that's basically the repository name and then check git status to check if you made any changes so you have made no changes it is updated with the file and if ever i may add some files over here that's not available in your folder in your local repository then what you have to do is directly just do git fetch so there there is nothing more that needs to be cloned that's why there is no message coming over here but if if there are any new files that you your local repository is not having then it will be cloned from here okay so this is what basically you have to do so i won't suggest you to use this method of downloading the zip file and then putting it over here because it's and it becomes very difficult for you to track the files and sometimes you make some unnecessary changes and your plugin may not work okay so better to use this method use this cloning method then if there are any update on this directly do the git fetch and you will get all your files within your gazebo plugin tutorial folder so all the commands i have mentioned over here okay you can follow them up now i request you to download these files and use them properly because if you are watching a tutorial series then ideal case you have to do is you have to watch the videos and you have to and you should try those plugins by yourself otherwise no benefit of this tutorial series once you start trying out the things then you will get more than just watching the videos okay now whenever you go on any plugin like this model plugin is there you will get the command to run those even i have explained in the videos that how you are going to run those for your case you can also look over here like how to launch this file same way for any other plugin so i try to make it as man as handy as possible so you can just look at them and you can just launch your file and run okay so that's it in the video and i hope you are going to download this and use it properly for this tutorial series